Are you a victim of purity culture trying to figure out how to have more fun and let go of all of the trauma in the bedroom with your spouse? And this one is for men and women. Hi, I'm Angela, the Christian expert. I want you to make some noise. One of the things that I find a lot of my clients struggle with is vocalizing their pleasure in the bedroom. When we vocalize our experience, we are grounding ourselves further into our body and getting out of our head more. And this can feel really awkward if you are someone who does not typically vocalize much. I'm not saying you have to immediately go for screaming in ecstasy. Start with little moans. Maybe a little yes or more. Don't stop. And when you start doing this, you're gonna be really tempted to move up into your head. So you really need to focus on staying grounded within your body. One of the things that I hear from guys in particular is that they taught themselves to be silent when they were self-pleasuring because we know that purity culture that that taught us that that was sinful. And so they would still self-pleasure, but they would do it silently so as not to get caught. And so it turns it into them being silent in the bedroom with their spouses. And so really focusing on vocalizing your experience can really help you break that negative association that has been created. Created. Follow me for more ways to break out of purity culture trauma because I teach you how to go have good sex.